not be morning time for you. Or maybe it is. But in case you don't remember, we are visiting with my friend, Chloe. She's spending time on her family's farm and sharing with us a little bit about mornings on the farm. It has been so much fun. Good morning, Callie. Good morning. What's happening on the farm this morning? Well, my Uncle Roger is letting me help with one of my favorite chores on the farm. Chores? Like doing things to help out? Which chore is your favorite? Oh, going around and feeding the animals. I love it. Why is that your favorite chore on the farm? Because I have a favorite cow. Her name is Betsy. She is the coolest. For one thing, she is the easiest to milk and she moves happily every time she sees me. My Uncle Roger says she only does that for me. The whole time I'm feeding her, I just chat with her and she loves the sound of my voice. Every time I get to help my Uncle Roger with feeding the cows, I know I get to meet with Betsy and that makes it my favorite chore. That is pretty cool. Betsy sounds awesome. We'll let you go out and see her while we check out our Bible story for today. Today's Bible story comes from the book of John chapter 20. After Jesus died on the cross, his friends or disciples were scared that the same people who went after Jesus would come after them. They locked all the doors and hid away. Even when they heard that Jesus was alive again, the disciples were still afraid. But Jesus came to them. Somehow, Jesus came into the room that they were hiding in even though the doors were all locked. Jesus told them that they did not need to be afraid because he was with them and he would always be. Then Jesus breathed on them. This was the way of giving his friends the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit was and is an amazing gift. The Holy Spirit is always with us no matter what. So because of the Holy Spirit, we can meet with Jesus every day every minute, every second. One of Jesus' friends named Thomas wasn't there when this happened, so he didn't believe that Jesus was really alive until Jesus appeared to Thomas himself. Thomas believed that Jesus was with him after he saw him with his own eyes. But you and me, even though we don't see Jesus right now, we know that he is with us. That's because the Holy Spirit is with us. Jesus made sure that we can wake up in the morning knowing I can meet with Jesus every day. Wow! Chloe gets so excited about the opportunity to see animals on the farm. How much more excited should we be that every single day we can meet with Jesus? Chloe and her favorite animal, Betsy, made me think about all the things I use milk for. Cows are where milk comes from. Some people use different kinds of milk that come from other places. But we use some kind of milk for a lot of things. Can you think of some? I put milk on my cereal. My dad and mom use milk for all sorts of recipes. But my absolute favorite thing to do with milk is dip my cookies in it. Hey, what if every time we use milk or something else that comes from a farm, we took a moment to be with Jesus? It's not hard. You can say, hi, Jesus. Thank you for this delicious peanut-free, I'm allergic to peanuts, cookie that I'm about to dip in milk. You rock, Jesus. I'm so happy that I can meet with Jesus every day. It's early.
today.